What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Showtime is the Blazing King, and welcome back. And for the finale of the Pokemon Diamond Adventure Lock, we're gonna be going to Unova after this. You know, unless we somehow let every single Pokemon we have in our PC die. But less likely out of that. I mean, come on, even if this team somehow dies, knock on wood. We ain't losing, baby. We ain't losing. This is the fucking adventure lock, man. We not stopping until we get to Gala. At the very least, you know, this this could push on. You know, like the fucking idea. Oh, we always hit fucking first three minutes. Ah, no, I was like, that joke's getting old. Anyway, like the idea that Frank and Ryan stole from it. Just kidding, guys. You're great by me. You know, although their idea for the generation race is kind of like my idea for this, minus a few details, but that's neither here nor there. Point is, we're going to Unova. Now, I, whether I'm doing just black or white, or just black or white too, or both of them, I haven't decided yet. Before I get that started, I'll have decided, so I know which I'm starting on. But with all that being said, we're going to get here with the team recap to show you guys what team we're taking going into this Elite Four fight. We have, of course, the big man, the OG, the man who came from our Sacred Gold playthrough to join us here in the very beginning. You know, after two disappointing starter options, we saw the light of God, the Arceus, the Dark Arceus, pour out of that dread play at level 60 with Punishment, Aura Sphere, Earth Power, and Strength. We have the Flying Saucer, the UFO, the Magnazone, ready for redemption here in Pokemon Diamond at level 60, pull out of the Zap play with Thunderbolt, Mirror Shot, Discharge and Thunder Wave. Good Geo. Cynthia's Ace. She's gonna be one of ours though. Or he's gonna be one of ours. At level 60. We're in the muscle band with Dragon Claw, Dig, Fire Fang, and Crunch. And making her return, my girl, Urza! Still standing tall at level 85, pulling out of the scope wedge with Blaze Kick. Sky Uppercut, Brave Bird, and Rock Climb, and if nobody, nobody else on my team can beat the rest of Cynthia's Pokemon, she will, I hold faith, everything in her, our overleveled mascot. Then we have Paul Russ, the Wall Rain, at level 60, wearing the Z Incense, with Surf, Aurora Beam, Sheer Cold, and Shock Wave, and last, we have Elmira wearing the wise glasses. She's a knockout, by the way, at level 60 with extra sensory, air slash, hypnosis, and dream eater. And now, before we fight our rival, and before we go into the Elite Four, we have. I had no one to buy quick balls there. Huh. Whatever. Actually, hold on. I'm going to sell literally everything I can't bring over into the new games. I'm going to sell one of these toxic plates since I'm only bringing one over. I'm taking the electrolyzer over. I'm taking everything. Like anything that, invo that can involve, involve, yeah, involve evolution, I'm taking over to the new game. Everything else, however, I'm selling. Or my plates. I'm keeping my plates too. Dragon Fang, I might actually see some use in. Nah, uh, well, you yeah, know. The Soothe Bell I should have kept for evolution reasons, but. Yeah. Leaf Stones I can buy somewhere in black and white, I'm pretty sure. Could be useful, but uh, oh geez, only 50. I'm just gonna hold on to it. It's only 15 dollars. Like, what the hell? 
I might make, I might decide to put the choice specs on somebody, depending on things. I might decide to use that. I don't have anybody with guts, so that's not useful. Having another muscle band might not be that bad. Oh wait, we have a uh, happening. I can put that on. So we'll buy, how many of these can we buy max? So we'll buy 20, we still have a lot of hyper, but we'll actually just buy 30 of these straight up. Actually, I can also sell all those TMs, I'm not going to. You know, Fake Out actually would have been really good to put on somebody, but... Hopefully in black and white we actually get better TMs from the gym leaders. And I'll just spend the rest on polar stores, I guess. Gentlemen, are you ready? Tell that you go if you have me here and say that I'm here too. Wah! I'm here too. We've spent seven minutes just dicking around in the beginning of the episode. What the hell? Team recap only took a couple minutes. Well, okay, the team recap took like half the time that we're at so far, I'm pretty sure, but yeah, you know, whatever. Oh shit, it lived. Wasn't expecting that. I think it living in yellow is probably better than it living in red, where it could actually quite screw me up. You know? That would, uh, not be good. I don't want to show off my true power by sending in the Blaziken unless he's 100%. Why do I use punishment instead of... It's a skip loom. What's it gonna do to me? In before it hits an extremely strong grass type move. But come on, it's the mid-evolution. I not surf. That still took a tap out. That's funny. Ah, oh, you. <clears throat> so you switch out to another grass type, okay? Oh, damn it, Liv! What the fuck? Didn't live for long, apparently. Did this motherfucker just do bounce, right? 
It doesn't really do much, but... A Scorpy! Oh, shoot. Too bad it's dead. Too bad I didn't find an Earthquake. That would've been pretty badass on the fucking Garchomp. Yeah, you go train and then maybe you can fight me when I'm sitting on the champion's chair. Do this. Your name isn't Aaron. What is your name, good sir? And what is the Elite Four class type change to? Gentleman Cammy, you aren't face facing the Elite Four. No, we are fighting the Gentleman. Actually, you know what? I think I should be fine to hit the Earth Pass. I just realized this thing might have Focus Blast. <laughs> Meanwhile, you just have Blaziken sitting in the back like, uh-huh, send out your PD Pokemon, bitch. You know, I never did understand why Noctowl wasn't a psychic type. Like, I could understand who who starting out as a normal flying. But why didn't Noctowl, like, turn into a psychic type? Then I got a similar question, why didn't Starling turn into a fighting type? My boy? Or I'm sorry, my girl? I think it's time you made your presence known. You know what? You wanna do this? You wanna go? You wanna send in the rock ember? Okay, we'll fucking go. Because unless you all speed me and debug me. You know, I could Okay. This is a crazy play. Mm-hmm. Yeah, see, that that's the kind of thing I want to avoid. I also don't want to send God out just to die. Okay, we'll 
I'll use a non super effect or non stab shockwave. Then we'll go for surf. And this is what's gonna save if I live or die. Stop, 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 stop! Are you fucking. I seriously don't believe that! I no longer respect you. Like, I'm. Oh, oh, oh! More, more good man! No, so I'm not a dragon type of sword as my ice type dies! Big fucking surprise! Fucking cunt! Fuck your pro. Fuck you. Fuck your dragon. Fuck your pro. No, shop. I don't even care. Shop, 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 shop. I already lost a fucking team member. I'm seriously the first Elite Four member in, and I already lost a team member. Ah. <sighs> Well, I'll say I'm trying to just take play skin and sweep through everything now. I'll be fair. Why do both of them have a shell gun? Yeah, I, I literally just stopped caring about, like, keeping the battles at normal speed because I, that first thing killing my team member already just hurt the shit out of me. I'm sorry, but... This is like a really small... Okay! Ow! How did you hit that hard? Holy fuck! I say, like I said in the last episode, Jesus, meet God. See now, the only bad part about this is if he survives and uses Transform. And I really hope now that I put that out in there, that is not what happens. I mean, I guess it's not that bad. Oh wait, actually, that's the okay. Oh, okay, that's fine. See, him <laughs> transforming would have been the worst possible thing because his type coverage actually handles everything on my team. I... Did I miss Sky Uppercut? Can I miss Sky Uppercut? What the fuck? I mean, that must have been what happened, right? Yeah, alright. Suicune! 
200 there is what the shit? No. Oh, oh, why? Oh, why? Oh, oh, no, come on! Oh, you got a really good hit in, and then you up uh, and die. Oh, dude. Dude, that was not cool. That did nothing. Fuck you, piece of shit. I don't want to use my last part. Wait. Okay. So we're down two. That really sucked Magnazone could not live up to his expectations. Like, I lose Magnazone in Heart Gold, and now I lost Magnazone here. Ah! Oh, my heart. Okay, you're gonna heal, so I'm gonna take my time to do the same. You know what? No. It's gonna take my time to do the same thing. I'm gonna one shot it. Yeah, this is one of those awkward situations. Good thing it's just a water type, so it can't do anything like extremely threatening. I mean, obviously, it can do extremely threatening things, but I don't think it gets like sheer cold or something. Really dive, alright. Calm down with your bad self. I want God to guide me through the next two fucking games. Or two, four, five, whatever games I have. How many games do I? I believe they're all the games, not just one of each generation. How many games do I have left? Because if I only play through one each, there's black or white. Or black black white or black white two. There's X Y and then there's Sun Moon or Ultra Sun and Moon, so I guess anywhere from three to five. Oh, your last Pokemon are just teeny. Oh, I know Cynthia is one tough cunt, and I'm prepared for it. All you motherfuckers already killed half my shit. Well, not quite half, but almost. I'm ready to take this bitch on. I'm even gonna use all these things.
Let's do this, the final challenge. Guess after I'm done uh, letting this edit, or letting this render, I have to figure out art for a new playthrough. And I don't want to start out season four of the adventure lock already. No, that, that that's not quite as entertaining. I don't know what I'm doing yet, but I know I'm doing something fun. Don't come back up and get hit by that. Yes! Good. That's a clean one shot. Now if it was a lantern, that would have been a thicker boy to deal with, but... Ugh. Urza, sweetheart, would you mind? Oh, of course it's her ace. Alright. Let's do this. Shall we? 19 levels above? I'm pretty sure we can one shot this motherfucker. Then again, who knows? It could live in here earthquake. But nope, that's the clean one shot on her ace. Therefore the rest of this is gonna be a breeze. In before she sends out something stupidly broken that's level 62. That's funny. School girl, Jimmy. That's funny. I could honestly send out Blaze King to take this on, but it's her last Pokemon. And what better way to end this playthrough than by Cynthia... Oh, no, it's her second to last Pokemon, whatever. I was about to make a judgment from God kind of joke, but... Excuse me? No. Sorry. A star me. You know what? I'm still staying in. Screw it. Literal judgment from God will be the ending of this battle. And I think that is 100% appropriate after my Magnazone and my Walrein lost their lives. Don't forget to press F in the comment section down below for our fallen comrades. Oh! Oh, she, was, she lives! She lives! Watch her pull counter on her ass! Oh my god, that would be awful. Stormy has counter and it's just like, oh no.
Oh, what, what, her last Pokemon fell, what does that mean? Oh, right, I think that means Season 3 is concluded. Let us remember, Gajil the Garchomp. Well, we met not too awful long ago, Elmira the Noctowl, who we actually got from Heart Gold. Our starter god. He brought us all the way through, and of course, our girl, Urza. Ah, and our fallen comrades. The wall rain we met at what is basically the safari zone of this region. And the Magna Zone we fished out of the water in Celestic Town. Press off in the comment selection for the two of them that lost their lives in this brave attempt at the ending of the Nuzlocke. But here we have our final team. Sure, we had one member come back to help us, but our starter lasted us all the way through and will now guide, be the Guiding light in the black and white. If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, ring that bell, like Facebook, follow Twitter, and Twitch, because I try and stream it up on every single day. And stay tuned for the next project starting tomorrow, the next day, whatever day I decide to do it. Maybe tomorrow I'll do some random miscellaneous video. Who knows? Who knows? If you enjoyed, though. Don't forget to do those things. Until next time, it's been the Wiz King. Signing out. Ta-ta for now.